Hey everybody, Dr. Play here. So in this tutorial, we're strictly going to be going over capturing gameplay off a PC or capture card for the console players. So you can start recording and streaming live right off of OBS. Let's get right into it. You're going to want to open up OBS. If you haven't already created a scene, you're going to want to click the plus button. Title the, sh the scene, whatever you want it to be. As you can see, I have plenty here. After you pick the one that you created, you're going to want to go over to sources. Now your guys' scenes and sources might be displayed below, uh, but it's the same thing. So you're going to want to go over to the plus button here. And you're going to want you go to either game capture if you're streaming off a PC. You're going to want to go to video capture device if you're going to be using an Elgato or any source of uh, capture card for uh, recording or streaming off of a console. So let's click plus. We're going to go to game capture and let's just type this new game okay this is going to be displayed you're not going to want this unless you prefer this i prefer capture specific window because now it's going to capture the only window that i want to run which is the game that you're going to want to play so there's going to be no pop-ups there's going to be no notifications anything that could possibly come in the front of your screen it won't come up it would be strictly gameplay and then all the overlays that you have will be there and nothing will get in the way, nothing will look ugly. So let me pop up a game here and we'll go from the next part. All right, so I have my game loaded up. And another reason why I like capture specific window is the simple fact if say OBS was the game you're playing, this background would show if you would use something else. So if using capture specific window makes it, like I said, strictly specifically the window of the game. So let's click on window and I currently have uh, held it loose up. So let's click on that and press OK. And that should come up once I click on the game. Oh, and there it is. So as you can see, none of my stuff is displaying. So I'm going to minimize the game for a minute. We're going to go back to the screen. As you can see right here when we created a game, it brought it all the way to the top. So this is basically showing that it is the top layer. No matter what is below it, this will show over all this other stuff. Um, and if you want to pop it back up again, there's a little eyeball. Just, just click it, brings the game right back up. So we're going to click it off, and we're going to grab this game, and we're, or this game capture, sorry. We're going to bring it on down. We're going to bring it all the way right there, and then I'm going to pop it back up. And now you see that all the overlays that I have up currently are in front of the game capture so that is for PC let's show let me show you how to do uh, consoles now capture cards all right for you console players what you're gonna want to do is press the plus button as well but instead of game capture we're gonna go all the way down to video capture device click on it you're gonna want to name it whatever name this console press OK this screen is gonna pop up Currently, it's showing my webcam, but in this case, we're going to show Elgato Capture Card or whatever capture device you're currently using. So after you get done clicking on the capture card, you choose the, the record off of an image of a pair, a little preview window up pair here, and also a preview window uh, on the OBS itself, as you can see in the top left corner, it pairs there. As you can see, it's not adjusted to fit the screen. So what we're going to want to do is go down to resolution slash FPS type. Go to custom. And you're going to want to adjust it to the size of your screen that you're currently using. Mine's uh, 1920 by 1080. And then I will, I always go to 60 frames. So that's what I'm going to do there. And we're going to press OK. So after pressing OK, you're going to see that the capture card is going to be displaying over all overlays if you currently have any displaying. Press that little eyeball. We're gonna go all the way back to the top and grab console. We're just gonna scroll it and bring it all the way down to the very bottom where it is gonna be displaying in the back. Like I said, anything up top is gonna to be overlays, things that are gonna be showing in the very top of everything. So let's click that eyeball. Let me click off display capture. And as you can see, my game capture is displaying right there with my overlays right above it. So if you guys found this tutorial useful, hit that thumbs up, share it to your friends, hit that sub button, notifications bell on. If you have any questions, please post in the comment. I'm very good at getting back to you guys. Until next time, take care.